you can find some fantastic deals on Steam and Origin Keys as well as Xbox Live, PSN codes and many more. Check out the G2A link in the description below or in the cards in the top right hand corner. Hey what is going on guys, Oznaminator here, hope you guys are doing well. Welcome back to Parkitect. Now they've actually released a new update since I last looked at it. We're now in pre-alpha pre 8 and they've added some new rides and all sorts of stuff. So we're going to jump in. We're actually going to load a park and we're going to load up a better starting park. Now this park will actually has changed a few things up from the main uh, normal base starting. So it's added the entrance into the center of the park rather than right down here in the corner right by this billboard. And they've added some seats along the path up to the entrance and they've also added the uh, they've also added the uh, drop-off points on the inside of the park rather on the rather than on the outside so first things first I've actually got a few mods installed and the first one we're going to look at is if I press F8 it brings up a scenario generator so we can actually generate a terrain so I'm going to just type in a seed just a random one like so. Uh, plane scale, we're going to bring that up a little bit. Max height, I think we're going to go up to maybe about five. Uh, max depth. Uh, ditch ratio, flood rounds, entrance clearance. Now let's just bring that down. So that'll keep the entrance kind of clear. Generate terrain type. And let's bring up the amount of trees. Oh, that doesn't actually... Let's click generate. All right, I've found one that I'm quite happy with. I am going to make a few changes, however. We're going to just go into terraforming and we're just going to make this whole section here mainly grass at the entrance. Um, so let's just drag that back to grass and there as well, just to like so. And let's just tidy this up to make it look a bit more randomized and yeah, it doesn't look really look that great but let's um let's just cut color this back in in the in the water to just give it a bit more so it doesn't look weird all right so and also I'm just going to flatten down this bit here at the entrance like so right now we're gonna go did I hire? Okay, we're going to get in 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. All right, we've got our staff. Now, let's go into rides, and I think I'm going to add a double Ferris wheel right here at the... Oh, we've got some sand still there, so let's, let's bring the double Ferris wheel back to about there. We'll add an entrance and an exit. And before we do anything else, we're just going to create, change that to grass there. There we go. Okay. So we can close that. We can open this. And let's make our path. Let's bring it down there. And there. There. We'll add some uh, garden beds in the middle there. Like so. Um, now let's go into paths. Now I've got this saved from previous time, so let's create that there. So we've got our path, uh, our entranceway, and we've got our exit. So we'll go out that way, like so. Now let's jump into scenery, and let's actually put in, let's go for some log flower boxes. Uh, let's change the color. Let's make them um, a bit of a maybe a bit of a blue flower. Oh, that looks nice. There we go. And we're going to add some benches around here as well, just to provide some people with some seating, like so. And there. Oh, we're not going to put it there. Oops. That's not what I was planning. All right, let's go back into scenery and let's place in some lamps. Oh, I like the look of this lamp. Let's see how that looks. Yeah, that looks all right. Place in some lamps. Oops. There we go. Okay. So we've got our first ride. We've got the 
double ferris wheel now one of the other mods that i've actually got is if you click on a ride and press the r button you can actually ride it so somebody has added in a coaster cam which is one of my favorite features of roller coaster tycoon 3 so you can actually ride your rides which we'll be exploring as we construct our roller coasters etc this this terrain definitely looks very nice it's definitely randomized which is good rather than having a flat park so that's good to see all right let's now go uh we're good we're just going to go five down that way and five down that way now we're going to add in some food stalls along these actually we're going to add in an info kiosk as well let's actually this path in the middle here let's remove that and let's add our info kiosk there which will come under here uh no not here under shops uh, let's go for the info kiosk right there there we go cool all right so now we're going to add some food stalls and shops and stuff so we're going to add in a balloon store uh we're going to go there with a balloon store then we're going to add some burgers uh we're going to go hot dogs and then i think we're going to go with some soft drinks and we're going to add a vending machine just here in the middle. Um, yeah, I think that's good. Um, and then perhaps on the other side, we're going to add in umbrellas because we do know that it rains. Uh, so we've got umbrellas. Let's add some snow cones. Mini donuts. Um, and good old cotton candy. Okay, so we've got our f food area over here. Now, down this way, I think we're gonna, just going to add in some toilets down this way. Uh, so let's go here and here. Okay. So as you can see, now our co resource collection point is here. So they will be delivering all the goods to where they need to go. Now, we're going to add in an employee. Oh, that's going to stuff that up never mind oh you, you seem to be wandering around let's pick you up and put you back uh let's place down let's replace that bench that we accidentally got rid of there we go okay so now we're also going to add down an employee path just down here just for them to go to the new staff room which i assume is where they can go to uh rest and just relax so there we go we've got a staff room there all right now let's jump into a roller coaster now which coaster so this is one of the new rides the ghost mansion ride which we'll be exploring later on so I'm thinking of going with a steel coaster but whereabouts are we gonna place that I think we'll go down this way um, let's go normal path so we're going to go to that way and we're going to bring it actually i'm going to change this up can we i'd like to delete that please just remove them sorry oh it's still got the people there oh dear and we're going to make this a double-ended path here now what did i have there whoops well we had balloons know that for one um then we had burgers, hot dogs, and soft drinks. Yep, there we go. Uh, now these shopkeepers are gonna. It's just they're gonna be stuck there, so we're gonna we're gonna delete them, get rid of them. Don't want them to be stuck there. All right. Now we've got our double ender path down here. We're gonna actually go this way up here. And we're going to actually inst install our first roller coaster just up here. I'm just going to flatten this here. Just here. Like so. And this will give us a nice area to uh, build our roller coasters in. Well, our first roller coaster anyway. So let's go into coasters. And did I open this? Was this open? 
I don't remember. Yes, it is. But nobody really wants to ride it at the moment. That's okay. Alright, let's go into here and go steel coaster. And we're just going to bring it back. We're going to rotate it around. So let's build out a few stations. Like so. Let's turn off station. We're going to go up a lift hill. We're going to go one, two, three, four, five. Uh, let's go up to there. We're going to flatten out. We're going to turn that off. We're going to drop down. Then we're going to go curve to the to the left and we're going to, just going to bank that slightly 30 degree bank actually let's go back and let's increase the size of that we're going to go 30 degree bank around the corner then we're going to go straight we're going to bring that back to zero we're going to bring that back to one then we're going to have our long drop right down back towards the ground like so uh, we're going to go flat to the ground oh this is going to be very tricky here just going to flatten this out a bit here otherwise this terrain is going to get in the way of our roller coaster building uh, let's just place down our entrance and exit right here okay so we're going to go down again and we're going to flatten it out like so and then I think we're going to go straight into a loop the loop to the right. Yep. All right. And then we're going to go. We're going to go up slightly. Like so. We're then going to curve around to the edge. Uh, we're going to rotate that by 30 degrees. Up like so. We're going to go straight. We're going to bring that back down to zero. Uh, we're going to build that. Then we're going to go down, down. I just want to flatten that out a bit here as well. Just here. There we go. And let's continue down. Down and flatten it out. Then we're going to go... I'm going to bend around this way. Um, actually no that's too I'm gonna bend that we're just gonna oh can't do that when we're down okay let's just go back this here let's go back we're just gonna increase the size so that's three and a half there we go and then we're gonna bend it that way we're gonna curve it 25 degrees that way like so then we're gonna bring it flat then we're going to go see if we can go up a bit like so probably hopefully that coaster will get up that it should be able to yeah it should be able to let's let's see if we can go just up one more and then we're going to bring it flat then we're going to go down and we're going to curve down as we go so we're going to go build build no 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 change plans we're going to bring that into a sharper turn and we're just going to bank that towards that direction we're going to build 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 um hang on this is yeah we're going down aren't we it's hard to get a bit of perspective on this but let's see how that goes can it get up there it can it's going to go around there then it's going to go actually we're going to come back to here we're going to go straight down we're going to bring that to a um, let's bring that to a flat surface we're going to bring that back to zero and we're going to go going to go straight and we're going to curve into here like so oh we've got Damn it. Let's flatten this terrain out a bit more. Like that. Oh. Looks like we've got to go back. Back. And we're just going to build that around. Like so. 
We're going to go straight this way. We're going to reset that to zero. Then we're just going to go like so. Um, no, we're going to go up. We're going to go back. Back. Straight. We're going to go up. Just up slightly. Up a bit more. Like so. Yep. Then we're going to bank this slightly towards that direction. It's going to go up. And we're going to bank this around. We're going to go come straight down. Oops. Nope. We're going to go. We're going to go a bit more. We're going to go two there. Uh, we're going to reset that. Then we're going to go come down. Oops. Wrong button. Oh no. There we go. That's exactly what I wanted. Uh, we're going to go down. No, no. Back. We're going to go bring that down to four. We're going to reset that, and we're just going to bring that around. Let's just bring that down to two. We're going to bring that around like so. Then we're going to add in some block breaks, and we're going to trim the speed down to five, like so. Actually, no, we're going to change plans. Oops. We're going to reset that to zero. We're going to go two there. Then we're going to bend it around like that. Then we're going to go straight. We're going to go block breaks. We're going to trim the speed down to five. Now this is the right level four. Yep. So there we go. We're going to place in two of them. Uh, we're going to go one more. Then we're going to disable that. And we're going to go out one. There we go. And we're going to bring it into the station. All right, there we go. Our first roller coaster built. I'm not the greatest at building roller coasters, but I think this turned out all right. So we're going to place in our paths first. So let's just switch into our colors. So we're just going to go this way. Oops. So there we've got our... There we go. We're going to bring this this way. We've got our exit there. And there we go. All right, we're going to test this and we're going to ride this. Let's let's bring down the cars per train to four and we're going to have three trains. So let's test this out and see how it goes. All right. We're ready to go. Here we go. Oh, dear. It's not too bad looking, in my opinion. Could be better. But here we go. Oh, dear. Uh oh, we've reached the top. Here goes nothing. Now bank turn. Oh dear. Ah! Ah! Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoop. Just made it up that hill. Dropped down again. Oh, we didn't change that bank turn there, but that's okay. Up here. Over the top of the entrance. Back down. And around and into the block breaks. There we go. Returning back to the station. Nice. I'm quite happy with that. So they'll stop there and it'll only release it once the next section is clear. Which could be a problem actually. Um, I think we're going to have to increase the speed that that drops it down to. All right, let's jump, jump out of that. No, we don't want to remove this. We're just going to edit this. Um, this section here, please. Here. We're just going to change that. We're going to stick with the 10 kilometers that it said. Just to make sure it doesn't crash. So let's test that again. And let's just, let's actually speed. You can actually speed up time, which is something I didn't realize. So we're going to speed that up gonna go right up to the top then it's gonna go down nice loop the loop up around the bank curve yeah this this bit here is is still banked I could have fixed that up while we we're fixing the block breaks but that's okay and we're up around here and back down towards the entrance 
Nice, we could have put a banked curve in there as well. There we go. That's slowed it down. That'll make it a bit faster into the station. Hopefully. Because once this arrives into the station, this will be released. Yeah, it gets released just as that pulls into the station. So as long as they're not they're not being released all at the same time, which is good. So that'll pull in and wait. So this, yeah, I think we'll be good to go. So let's open this up. If it crashes, my bad. Oh, all right. There we go. Our first roller coaster built in our park, as well as our double Ferris wheel, which nobody seems to give an F about. But I don't think we have too many guests at the moment. We've only got 22 guests at the moment, so that's probably why everything's a bit quiet at the moment. But now that we've got roller coasters in, I think we'll be good. We've got some people going on the roller coaster. Cool. All right. Well, that was my first episode of my Let's Play on. Parkitect. If you've enjoyed this video and would like to see more, please give the video a thumbs up. And down in the description below, you can find my Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram links. As well, I'll have the links to the mods that I've got installed down there as well, and the link to the Parkitect website where you can purchase into the pre-alpha. Also, if you're new around here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more videos like this one and other gaming and modding content. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.